The next Chrome extension is Alpha Text, and Alpha Text will customize and change the appearance of online articles to enhance the text readability. Um, so what I have over here is assistance with reading, um, especially for those with low vision. Here's the link. Here's the description on the Chrome Web Store. It is very highly rated. You can read through the reviews. Um, the reviews are good to get you to give you tips and tricks um, for how to use it as well. So um, I have it done. I have it installed already. It's up here in the right hand corner. Let's first go to Wikipedia and click it. And let's see what we can do. We'll give it a chance here. Profiles, quick styles. What if we do a 14 in a different font? Will it? I don't know why it's. Hmm. Okay. The next Chrome extension is Alpha Text. And what you can do with Alpha Text is you can customize and change the appearance of online articles to enhance the text readability. So again, there's a lot of applications here for those with low vision or again, if you have students or, your, or you yourself are sensitive after reading online for a long time and you want to be able to adjust the, the maybe the color of the background or the size of the font or the spacing between the font, um, on the article itself. So um, here is the link. Here is the description on the Chrome Web Store. I have already added it to Chrome. It's right up there in the top right hand side. Let's go to Wikipedia first and see what it looks like. So here's the default um, view of the Wikipedia web page. But if I click on the alpha text, what I did is I went in by using the options. I went in and I set my own profiles. So I did three different profiles with different font size, font styles, and line height. And you can see I set those as these three profiles. So when you go into your article then, I'm going to show you the differences. So here again, the default view, here's what it is. With my first profile of larger font, a different font, and more space between the lines of text. And again, even larger and more space. And again, larger, different font, more space. So within this um, screen as well, so I have my defaults, I can go over here and I can change the background. What if I like the high contrast? I can adjust my colors and now I've got high contrast. Ah, oh, that media, even though I love our, our emblem, let's just say it's too distracting over here, so I want to hide it. So I'm going to hide that and um, again, just try to give myself an easier format to read. Clear those. Let's go to Yahoo. You'll see it's the same principle. Let me see, I'm going to let this load though so I can turn off the video. Maybe. There we go. So if I go to the text, um, yeah, the text is a little bit larger already on Yahoo, but you can see here the difference, and then again the difference, and if you wanted to change the colors, if that makes it easier for you to read, let's hide the media. Boom, there we go. So this is a really good extension um, for kind of clearing away all the mess and making um, the readability of those articles a lot easier.